Hey gang, welcome back to another episode of uh, windshield tours. Today's going to be a windshield slash walking tour like so many are. Alright, today we're out at San Salito, which is here in St. Augustine. Basically inside the city limits. What a beautiful community being developed by D.R. Horton. Um, about 400 or so homes in here, ranging from about 250 to the mid, from about the mid 200s to the mid 300s. Okay, beautiful. A lot of different floor plans to choose from. A lot of different three bedrooms, four bedrooms, two cars, three cars. Lots of different stuff. And the amenities in here are fantastic. Low HOA, zero CDD, no CDD. So um, some of the northern communities that have some of the same things we have here. Are you're gonna see a lot? So you're gonna see CDDs. There is none here. Okay, but you're inside the city of St. Augustine, so the taxes may be a little a tick higher, not much. So not enough to offset the great amenities they have here. So let's go take a drive around. Again, they're building it as we speak. It's been here um, now um, a, between one and two years, and uh, they got a lot of homes in here. Okay, so let's take a little drive through the community. We'll see some great homes, and we'll see some in various stages of of um, completion some are sold some are available pretty much as soon as they build them they're they're selling them so like everything else in st john's county it's um it's an amazing place all right so what we're going to do before we um go drive around we're going to just drive straight ahead this is the amenity center here in san salito so let's get out and we'll do a little walking portion of the tour and we'll show you a little bit of this area here Again, great place to raise a family. A lot of families here. Kids, um, everything. It's beautiful. Great St. John's County schools that we enjoy um, with these, um, pr these, uh, this, this, uh, these aggressively priced homes. Beautifully priced homes. A lot of great stuff here. Okay, over there we got a volleyball court. Wave everybody. We're playing volleyball today. Very cool. All right. We're going to take a walk around to the where the pool area is and the little clubhouse meeting area sitting area. You won't be able to get in because they got it key carded so we'll be able to see it from a couple of different angles. Okay. So as you can see, very nice pool area, nice sitting areas, exercise room over there. Kind of a meeting area on that side. Very nice area. Let's go walk around a little bit more. I'll show you some more great features of the amenity center. Like I said, on the weekends, I've been by here on the weekends and it's amazing how many people are hanging out here, having a great time. We'll get another view of the pool from this side. The, um, the play area for the kids. There's tennis courts. Let's see if we can get you another view of the pool. There's a great view of the pool. Again, we can't get in because we don't have the proper key card today. But there you go. Restroom facilities, showers. DR Horton's done an amazing job down here. All right, so let's take a little bit further walk. Here we got a kid's little water feature area. The little guys can play in that and ride your bicycles up. They got bicycle racks, again, those tennis courts. Looks like basketball courts. Very nice. Dear Horton's done a great job in here. Look at jogging. She's down there jogging. I think she's actually chasing the volleyball or something. But uh, maybe little picnic areas, a lot of green space. Look at this lake real quick. Again, restrooms all key coded so not anybody can just wander in. HOA maintains everything here. Beautiful lake just to see you can sit by, hang out, have a little picnic lunch maybe. Yep, there's a soccer ball went in the went in the water. Look at this great lake they got. Beautiful. A little back entry, another view of the pool and the back side of the uh, amenity center, the clubhouse. There's the volleyball court over to the right. They probably have a ton of community gatherings here, so that's kind of cool. All right, let's head back to the car. We'll do a little run around the community in the car, a little.
Hey, do you live here? Do you, do you live here? Yeah, down the road. Alright, real quick. Do you mind just answering a couple quick questions? I'm doing a videotape for a um, for our website. For our, we're real estate agents. Why do you live here? Um, is, it, is it cool here? Oh yeah, it's really yeah, cool. Yeah, is there a lot of community activities and stuff? Mm -hmm. There's starting to be a lot. Oh yeah? Nice, because the community's only been here like a year and a half, somewhere like that. Yeah, so. I'm enjoying playing beach volleyball. That's cool. All right, well, nice. so a lot of kids in the neighborhood, a lot of families, a lot of things like that? Awesome. Sweet. Oh, nice. Yeah, I think that's, hey, that's a bonus, right? Yeah. All right, have a great day. Thanks a lot. See you later. Little uh, girl off the street opinion. Anyway, go back to our car. All right. All right, here we go. Back to our car. Again, a lot of great things happening here. So um, it's a great time to get in here because they got a lot more building to do in here. So as the um, as it gets closer to being finished, of course, prices in any community always escalate. And as real estate agents, our best ability to negotiate deals is always on builder specs. Building from scratch is great, and we do a great job for you. But you have less negotiation power at that point. But you can also, on price you do, but you, sometimes you can get more goodies put in the home. You know, we can negotiate for that aspect of it. Um, so, either way, depends on what you might be looking for in your time frames. Okay? Alright, so let's get back in the car. Let's get back in the car and we'll go for a little ride around the community. We appreciate you tuning in on our YouTube channel. Let me get my seatbelt on because it's going to ding, ding, ding on me. All right. Stand by. All right. Looking at that great lake over there. Again, like I said, we appreciate you guys. Let's take a little, take a little drive around. All right, we'll go through some of the completed areas. You'll see some homes under construction and various stages of construction. A lot of different models, different um, architecture, different elevations. So they're making it really, um, they're doing a great job in here with making it a lot of variety. So it's not a, it's not a, it's not a cookie cutter community. Central mailboxes. A lot of different folks living in here, a lot of families retired folks so it's a good mix I believe two car garages three car garages two stories one story so they've done a great job in mixing it up paver driveways concrete driveways so it keeps it interesting keeps it interesting There's one, got some dirt cleared over here. We've got the rough in plumbing done. We're getting some frame boards up for pouring the foundation. Versus these guys over on this side. Oh, sorry. This one's obviously in framing. Okay. So let me get out of the way of this guy. I got that one's in framing. So a lot of different various stages, a lot of different architectural styles, like I said. They've got a lot of um, homes ready to go in here right now, as they will always have, but they have a lot that are sold as well. So let's take a little, maybe take a little ride this way, see what we got down here. That one on our right sold, okay. This one on our left is sold as well. So people are buying them in various stages of construction, depending on what they're looking for. And again, that's the way it is in just about every community. People, buy, they find, they come, that one's sold. That's available. So you got a couple of available, a couple sold. Well, wow, three solds in a row. So anyway, so different houses, different architectural designs on pretty good sized lots in here. Definitely backing up to preserve property as well. So that's that's awesome. So no one's going to build behind you. All right. And this is kind of a little dead end. So 
folks that buy down here is going to be kind of cool because they're going to have a big giant parking spot. Again, um, no CDD, low HOA with all the amenities that you can find in just about any community. This one's probably got more than you find in a lot of communities. With that, well, the outdoor sports courts, the gathering areas, the pools. So it's a, it's a big deal. Um, close into St. Augustine, 10 minute ride to the interstate. Great high school, uh, middle school, elementary schools close by. Heading back towards the front, but we're going to take a left here and show you some other areas within the community. So as you go down this street, we're not going to go all the way down because they're, at the end is where they're clearing more land for more homes. So down this street, you got again got homes in various stages of constru in, in construction, some available, some sold. Okay, so we'll head back up this way on Pullman Circle. So we're going to head back towards the front of the community, putting all underground utilities in. Sold, available, so lots of lots of cool stuff going on here. A lot of, they use flat stock, flat stack rock on some. They use like that one right there. Okay, versus an all, an, an all stucco front, maybe like that one there. Okay. See the attention to detail they put around. Look at the front of that with the uh, paint colors and everything where they've indented the um, stucco. Very cool. Okay, we passed some earlier that had the uh, hardy board lap siding. There's some right there. There's some hardy board lap siding. So, and they have diff all their different um, homes have different elevations. So, um, picking and choosing what specifically you like is definitely something you can do in here. And with as many homes as you got left to do in here, there'll be plenty. Here comes one there. This is kind of a cool looking one here. Check this one out. Flat stack going all the way to the all the way to the roof line on one one side. Nice accent piece with a three car garage. Very nice. So we really do appreciate you guys hanging out with us on these windshield tours. I know they're a little bumpy, but um, this way you gotta get a real good view of what it would be like to uh, kind of drive through the community and um, get a feel for it. So. We appreciate you guys. There's the amenity center on our right again, but the, let's stop here for a second. We got the tennis courts, basketball court looks like, yep, over behind us. Okay, children's play area, water park, a little water park for the kids, for the little guys and girls. Okay, so very cool. All right, we're coming up to the front entrance of San Salito again. Again, this is uh, San Salito being built by D.R. Horton. Um, making very good homes, very nice homes, well well appointed and well priced. Um, so lots of cool stuff in here. All right. So I want you guys to have a fantastic day. And again, we appreciate you hanging out with us on another windshield tour. Let me give you another shot of that cool sign. We'll go on this side this time. You can see that? Very nice. Huge, beautiful entrance. Beautiful entrance. Okay. So anyway. This is off Woodlawn Road here in St. Augustine. I want you guys to have a fantastic day. Thank you.